Hi, I'm Jan Wenzel, Chief Productivity Guru at Life Contained. I'm going to show you how to create and then retrieve email templates. If you find you send the same message over and over again, I think you're really going to like this lesson. So let's get into Outlook. So before we can create the template, we have to turn off Word as your email editor. And I'm not exactly sure why this has to happen. I just know that it has to happen for us to create the template. And then we have to go back in and turn Word back on so that you can continue to get spell check and all the other great things that Word has to offer. So the first thing that we're going to do is we're going to go to the Tools menu and we'll go down to Options. From here, we'll choose the third tab over, Mail Format. And in here, there are a couple of click tick boxes at the top. Uncheck that first one, which says that Word will edit your email messages. And then at the bottom, we'll click Apply, and we'll click OK. So Word is officially off. And so now we just go in and create a template for a message that we send often. So we'll start with a new mail message. And what I'm going to demo is one of the messages that I create frequently for people who have found my website but are unsure about the investment structure. And you can save the two line, the CC line, the subject line, you can save attachments, the body copy, all sorts of things. And it'll just depend on the message that you're creating as what you'll want to save within your template. So because my two line is going to be different each time, I'll just go down and save the subject line as life contained investment structure. And then I have this created and I have several different paragraphs that include links and I also often have an attachment so the template that I've created has an attachment on it as well. And so we're just going to put in some Greek copy here. And we'll have kind regards. And now that you have your message structured, all we need to do is go to File, and we're going to go Save As. So this is a step that you don't typically do in Outlook for your mail. And what we're going to do is we're going to ask it to save as a very particular type. So we're going to go down to the far drop-down menu, and we're going to choose Outlook template. And we're going to name it. I like the name that it has. It gives you your subject line name. And so I'm going to keep that as is. And I'm going to click Save. Okay, so that officially saved the template. So now what we'll do is we'll close this message. And I'll ask if you want to save the changes. Because we've already done it, we're going to say no. And then something funny happens. It usually creates this message that you just saved in your Outbox. So go into your Outbox, select that message, and delete it because we saved it in another area. And now that it's saved, we're going to go ahead and turn Word as our editor back on so that we can begin to use that template that we just created. So we'll go back to Tools and back to Options. We'll go to that third tab again, the Mail Format tab. And now we're going to tick that first box, Use Microsoft Word to edit email messages. We'll click Apply and we'll click OK. So now we have Word working again and we have our template created. And so now we can go into the Tools menu to recall this template. And you do that by going to Forms, and we'll select Choose a Form. 
and we're going to look in a particular area and that is user templates in file system and select that and there is the template that we just created if you create multiple templates you'll see a big list of them so you highlight the one that you want to open you hit the open key and voila there is the message that we created and now all you need to do is put the information in the two line and if you need any changes in the copy you're able to make the changes before you press send so I hope this method saves you bundles of time I'm Jan Wenzel thanks for tuning in to Life Contained